Snowball and his forest friends, good bedtime stories for kids. Snowball and his forest friends, good bedtime stories for kids. Today we have a book named Snowball and his forest friends, good bedtime stories for kids. I think they're so pretty. I hope you guys really enjoy it. I love it. Please give this video a like if you enjoy it. And don't forget to subscribe for more stories. Thank you, reading. So, here we go. This is one of the amazing animal stories for kids in English. One day, the forest god created an animal. It was called Snowball. Snowball was round. His fur was very white. He was a beautiful animal. All the animals liked him. However, Snowball was mean. He was always very rude and mean to others. He was roaming in the forest. While he was roaming, he met Piggy. Your nose is so funny. It is looking at the sky, laughed Snowball. Piggy started crying. Further, on his way, he met Squirrel. Snowball, come play with me, said Squirrel. No, you are too small, laughed Snowball. The Squirrel became very sad. Next, Snowball met Deer. You have twigs on your head, cried Snowball. The Deer, too, got upset. Snowball kept walking, and he was humming a song. Soon, he passed by a hen. The hen said, Hello, Snowball. Let's be friends. No, look at your ugly red hat, laughed Snowball, and he again made the fun of his forest pal. The hen was embarrassed. All the animals did not like Snowball anymore. All the other animals came up together for a meeting and decided to ignore him. He is so mean. Why, he is so beautiful. It's not fair, said the animal. I am not going to be his friend, cried the pig. The forest god called Snowball and said, Snowball, stop being mean to others, otherwise your fur will fall out. But Snowball didn't care and he kept on teasing other animals. His fur started falling off. Soon, he had no fur. Snowball began to cry and said, I won't tease anyone. Please give me my fur. Seeing him sad, the forest god appeared. He said, go to the forest, make new friends. Only then your fur would grow. If you cannot make friends, your body will grow. Snowball went into the forest. He went to Piggy first, but Piggy ignored him and immediately disappeared. Snowball's body grew. Snowball saw Squirrel and tried talking to her, but she too ignored him and ran away. Snowball's body grew again. Snowball saw Rabbit and Bear, but they too ignored him. Nobody will be my friend, cried Snowball. His body grew longer and longer. Snowball's fur did not grow at all. His legs, too, disappeared. Now his body was very long. The other animals laughed at Snowball. You have no fur! You are so ugly! They yelled. Snowball was ashamed of himself and he hid inside the cave. He was all alone. I was so mean, he cried but it was too late to realize his mistake. Time went by and Snowball forgot about his beauty. He slid across the cold ground. All the animals, too, forgot about Snowball. He had a new name now. He is called Snake since that day. The End Good job, friends. Thank you so much for reading with me. Bye, I'll see you next time.